Hello, welcome back, my beautiful soul subscribers. It's your girl and known goddess Tarot. How is everyone doing tonight? If this is your first time joining, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification button for when I'm coming with the latest videos. You'll be notified. Yes, um, ladies, I just wanted to let you guys know this is what I'm wearing right here. Uh, yesterday I wore the blue bodysuit. This is the red Senorita bodysuit. Okay. It's the all-in-one um, thong type, okay? And it has a really good stretch, and it's a um, one-size-fit-all, okay? So I'm feeling like a real senorita, okay? Feeling grounded today, baby, was not so bad. It was a little gloomy, but brightened up my energy, honey. I don't let no other get me down. All right. All right. So um, if you are seeking a personal reading, uh, go ahead and check that out on my website and check out our, our body suits. You can get three for 30 or at the regular price. OK, so go ahead and check that out. Um, this reading is going to be for my lovely earth signs. Yes, this is a love reading. All right. So um, I heard the song. I don't know who this artist is. I heard I keep forget. That I'm not in love anymore. Don't mind my voice, y'all. I'm nobody singing. But that's what I heard. So I feel like this person, my earth sign, they pretend as if they're not in love with you. Maybe playing these mind games. I don't know. Let's see what's going on out here. But Or maybe they act out in such a jealous way, but they acting like they, oh, never mind. I don't care. Like, I don't know. Like I keep forget that I'm not in love with you anymore, right? Maybe this is an ex lover that keep reminiscing, holding themselves all up in their head. Yeah, let's see what's going on out here. All right, my spiritual guides, angels. I ask that you give me clear, honest messages from my beautiful Earth side. As I open these realms of these love messages, I ask that you protect my aura and my chakras. You can use me as a vessel so won't it be. Yes. All right. Uh, don't forget, check out my website if you're seeking a personal reading. And the latest spring fashion. All right. So we're going to use the numerology deck out here, my Uno deck. All right, my beautiful earth size. Let's see what's going on out here. So, four, heart chakra. Mm. Someone's feeling unbalanced. This emperor, four also represents an emperor. Uh, this emperor could be uh, Aries. This person could be a Cancer with the four out here. Uh, this person could be a, a Taurus or a Scorpio, maybe. Mm -hmm. But this emperor is really, uh, yeah, they say they keep forget that they're not in love anymore, but this is how they're feeling. They're feeling upset. I feel like they're very unbalanced. Yeah. Mm. I see what's going on here. What else is going on, in my guy, too? High priestess, union, couple, duality, balance. Maybe y'all separated from this person. Mm -hmm. Six represents home balance. This person ain't feeling balanced out here. Here go that six. They're feeling unstable. Maybe, yeah, you block this person. Uh, you guys are just not in a co uh, not cooperating. There's no harmony. There's no peace out here in this home situation. This is a six. Maybe y'all are still in the home together. This is an emperor and a em um, high priestess, a feminine energy. This two, this two. Uh, this also represents a a, a Taurus. Mm -hmm. This person can have a, a Cancer in their chart. Or this person could be a fire sign as well. Yeah. See what else is going on out here, honey. At the bottom of the deck, it's just wild out here. A lot of arguments going on out here. What's good out here? Any more, Carl Spett? Any more? It's wild out here. Yeah. 
feel like there's so many arguments out here. Nobody's bringing and no, no one's hearing anybody. Everybody's above everybody. Everybody wants dominance and yeah. There's no balance out here. Things are not coming to a finale out here. This is like the nine. This is like a nine of pentacles energy in reverse. Could be arguments over money. Yeah, somebody wants to move off. Somebody feels unbalanced with this high priestess. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel like whatever this high priestess, empress, this this lover out here did to this uh, emperor, yes, it's bringing on. It's not stable in this home. I'm gonna tell you that right now. This is like the, this this could be a Libra you're dealing with. My fight, my um earth signs. Yeah, yeah. Whatever's going on out here is definitely unbalanced. Somebody wants control. Somebody wants to have control in this situation. I, I feel like this is the battle of, of power in the home. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, let's see what's going on out here. All right, let's pull it down, baby. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and hit the notification button. My Earth Suns. All right, the more thumbs up we get on the videos, they circulate, and yeah, let's get popping out here, baby. Oh, oh, oh! Somebody, somebody needs spiritual protection around here. Mm-hmm. Somebody needs spiritual protection around here. Let's see what's going on, Spirit. Let's use the secret of tarot. Look at that. Somebody needs to get their chakras balanced out here. Lord have mercy. Somebody needs to get the truth. Somebody needs to get balanced. They're feeling like they're codependent out here. Mm hmm Yeah, right here. I feel like this... With this 11 out here in the reverse, I don't feel like this marriage was like spiritually guided by God. It was it was more like a money situation. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's clarify. Oh, see what this for. Yeah, this emperor, this lover, mm -hmm, they have options out here. They want to go, they want to move off. They definitely moved off. Yeah, they're looking forward to their own money situations right now. They're looking out to find different options out here. But with the four in the reverse, I feel like this person feels unstable. Yeah, this emperor with this with this lover in the home, I feel like they was feeling uh, wondering where this money was going. Okay? And, yeah, let's keep clarifying though. With the seven of cups out here, yeah, all that glitter isn't gold. And I feel like this lover, this 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 emperor, I feel like they realize this em this high priestess, this person who they possibly live with, married to, all it was all about was money. And this person, this em this high priestess didn't bring any type of inner peace. You know, this high priestess is definitely somebody who's um, in the reverse, lack of their own stability, lack of their own um, creative energy, you know, lack of bringing balance to their own life. Okay, yeah. Because with the seven out here, I feel like with the seven right here, the seven of cups and the seven out here in reverse in the solar plex energy, yeah, this person couldn't come create their own balance, their own stability. They depended on this emperor out here. They depended on the head of the household, whoever this is. Emperor, empress, take it how it resonates. Yeah. They depended on this person. And this emperor was like, I had enough. You're not who I thought you were. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah. They, they can't come to a finale out here. Can't come to things. I feel like this high, this high priestess, nine represents, I got my notes out here for y'all. Nine represents a finale, but not complete. Okay, this this empress out here, this high priestess, doesn't feel like she could, you know, create her own balance and her own options out here without this without this lover in the home. Yeah, this lover out here was the one that was keeping up the balance in this four of wands, this hard emotions. But this this emperor said, "I am done. I'm not doing that anymore." Yeah, with the seven and the four out here, this is an eleven. Yeah, he wants his own new beginnings. This is like the two of wands, taking the two of wands action, looking forward out to his own new beginnings, looking out and trying to figure out his own uh, options out here. Because he realized, and with you, this this marriage was not spiritually guided. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, this marriage was not spiritually guided. And this and she and she only married or he only married for money. 
Okay. So right now, because this emperor, head of the household, decides to move away, no longer having these emotional fulfillments anymore with this person. This is like the four of cups in, re in reverse. Um, this is okay. So when you, I take the four of cups, like when it's in the upright, okay. This is the heart chakra. This is about forgiveness. This is about compassion. Okay. But in tarot, it, and I'm using this in Uno, but in the tarot, it's like, I'm not accepting any of your offers. This I, I got to think about it. You feel what I'm saying? I got to think about it. I got to think about the other options that I might have out here. Okay. But this emperor is like, oh, hell no. I'm not even thinking about no offers out here. Four of cups in reverse. I ain't even thinking about you. I got, I'm about to out here make my make my own moves out here. I'm about to jump in my chariot energy. Yeah, so they, they tapping into their emotions out here deeply, this emperor. Yeah. They tapping into the air. They looking beyond the clouds and, get, and figure, figuring a way out to get away from this empress. This, this high priestess person, because all they about is this bread. And they figuring out how can I get myself balanced out here because fucking with you, I'm on I'm unbalanced. Seven and seven. One and a four. This one represents this, this masculine. This lover out here is trying to manifest their new beginnings of their own magician energy and try to get gain back their own balance out here. Because messing with this high priestess, they lose their money. They unbalanced. Okay, and I feel like that's what's causing this issue. This is why she, this, this, this feminine, that's why they feel upset. Okay, they're not bringing, they, they're at war. They're wilding out out here. <laughs> this came out, damn. This came out in the, I, I want to say the water sign readings. Yeah, this is coming out a lot. And it's always the, the main man. Damn, yo. Or the main woman. Okay, let's see what's going on out here. See what else is going on here. Tower moment. What did I say? Look what's at the bottom of the deck. He want, he is not can wear this high priestess anymore. Brought down the tower on it. I told you he feels like, or she feels like, take it how it resonates. Do remember energy is fluid in, in, in um, tower. So, yeah, the tower is brought down in this home situation out here. What did I say? Yeah. There go that one. I told you he was out here trying to, yeah, with the 11. He's like, I'm done. I'm out here with my own magician energy. I'm trying to manifest my own beginnings. He brought down this home situation. Four, five, six. Tower. There it go. Wilding out. That's what's going on out here. Arguments. Okay? Yeah. This should happen suddenly. I feel like he was he was secretly hiding this. He was figuring out how to figure. I feel like this lover out here, if this is you, my earth signs, I feel like when you was you were in this motion, y'all was some of y'all was still in the home. That's why probably it was so sudden and shocking to this high priestess. Yeah, it was probably sudden and shocking. And also with the six out here, it also represent that devil energy. Yes, yeah, so I feel like this lover was also trying to use this manipulation, using this money for this manipulation out here to keep it together. And when it fell, it, it was a total shock to them. It was definitely shocking to them. They didn't, she, he or she didn't expect this. No, they didn't. They did not expect this. No, they did not. That's why it's, that's why it's shocking to them. Yeah, that's why they in this reverse. This two, this, this two is about reverse lovers. Two of cups. Two of pentacles. Yeah, no more juggling with you. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Hell Yeah. Six, seven, eight. Justice was brought out here. Shocked when they got the news. Didn't I tell you? This emperor, this lover, whoever this is, they decided no more. No more. I'm tapping into spirit. I'm out here contemplating secretly. I feel like some of y'all was in the home while y'all was planning to figure out your own options to gain back your balance and your abundance. This is the seven of cups energy. Yeah, definitely went in. Definitely went in and had a master plan. I'm here thinking of a master plan. Yeah. Brought the shock on this person right here. This lover was shocked right here. This is the, yeah, they were shocked. Okay. That's what's going on so far. Now they're feeling stuck. I feel like this person could be also a, a fire sign, a Leo. 
This person could be a Libra. Yeah. They're feeling unbalanced out here. Whatever their willpower, whatever their controlling ways that they had, they thought they had this on lock. This lover thought they had it on lock until you dropped the bomb on them and dropped the tower on them. They were surprised out here. You're gonna find this seven in reverse, right? Oh, yeah, what did I say? Oh, what did I say? You moved off. Now they feel at heart. Ten of Swords, they all up in their head. Yeah, death ending, end of a situation or relationship. Did I tell you? You did, yeah, look at that. And yeah, it's, it's done. I told you, you were in here thinking of a master plan, how to end this situation. Now they're feeling stuck. Whatever they was trying to do with this uh, this chariot energy to keep you from moving forward, it's over. It's been, it's justice been served out here, baby. Yeah, they magician work was flipped upside down. Wherever they was going to make these moves, spending their money on to keep you in this um, in this lover's energy out here, to try to keep you uh, trapped because of this money situation. Yeah, stabbed in the back. They've been, yeah, it's been returned onto them. The relationship has ended. Ten of, ten of swords. This is a secret of tarot deck. Ten of swords, death or ending of situation or relationship. Boom. It is done. Over. I feel like somebody found out that somebody was out here pulling these stunts on them. This is out here a lot. I swear. All the spell work, all the secrets, everything is coming to, it's like everything is coming to light. Here go the 11 again. There go the 11. I can't make it up. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Here it is. You tapped in. I feel like you, the earth sign, was trying to sit right here. And whatever you saw, you really started to realize all that glitter was not gold. Right? And you started looking beyond the clouds. You started seeing your money improvements. I feel like you was here secretly trying to manifest how to get the hell away from this high priestess, from this lover right here. And you figured it out. You tapped in with your spirit guides. You got into your magician energy. And you brought the shit to an end. 10, 11. Can't make it up. Okay? That's what's going on out here. Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly what's going on out here. All right. So let's see what's going on. Let's, let's pull the rest of this message out here. It's wild out here. Clarify this. And then, yeah, you, you realize what they was doing. Yeah. Change. What did I say? You in this hermit energy. You made those moves and made the change. Yeah. But I say this nine is all about, maybe you're in this um, hermit energy. Nine is a Virgo. Nine can represent that Virgo energy, hermit. Yeah, you're probably in this hermit energy make, making these moves. You see this, this, this chariot out here sitting here? Yeah, you're moving off. I feel like for some of y'all, like I said, nine represents something coming to a finale, but still waiting for completion. Whatever it is, you gained the wisdom. Yeah, you did. Uh, um, you started forgiving yourself. All right. Yeah. You, you learned the lesson. You seen shit for what it was. Yeah. You take responsibility for how you was aiding this, this, this codependent person. This person was very dependent. This high priestess, very dependent. And they was out here trying to pull this magical stunts on you to keep you from seeing the truth about this money situation as well. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. Because you see this yellow, this yellow is, this represents your solar plex um, energy, okay? This is the third chakra. This is all about your inner peace, personal power, self-confidence, self-worth, you know, um, accepting and trusting and um, your gut feelings, right? Yeah. So this person, this, this lover that was in the home with you, yeah, they was definitely tapping into this work out here. They was definitely tapping into this inner work out here to keep you right here to keep them because they seen you as their they seen you as their money situation. They seen you the one that's bringing this balance to them. You're the one that brings the manifestations out here. You're the one that tap into your higher knowing and put the hard work in and bringing your material things and you know manifest what you want. And they are not able to do that. No, they're not. So they're very upset. They didn't expect this was wild and shocking news to them, honey. They didn't expect the tower moment. No, they did not. This lover did not. Like I said, two, four, six. This is this lover's energy in reverse. Yeah. 
This person was definitely on their devil energy vibe, and this also could represent a Virgo. You were the one that was bringing in this money for this for this high priestess that you let go of. Okay. Mm hmm. But you definitely made them made those moves and made those changes. Yes, you are. Some of y'all are still waiting for final judgment out here. You're in this hermit mode. Clarify this high high priestess tower moment. Yeah. Whatever's going on in the home. Came to an end. Definitely brought it to an end. Mind living there? All right. Let's see what I said. Spirit definitely took over on this one. The 11s are out here. Clear for the high priestess tower energy. Who is this? Who is this high priestess? Oh. The main man. Yeah, so this high priestess was out here with this this main man. This main man brought down the judgment on this person. Yeah, the, the, the emperor out here. Yeah. He had some type of concerns. Something was going on that triggered him to, 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 to start thinking. Okay? Yeah. Something about something got him triggered, like, wait a minute. Am I the only one pulling in this money out here? I'm the only one that's being consistent. Am I the only one with the, the cr creative assertions out here? What's really going on? Where's the money going? Yeah. And they started, this main man started cons considering, a, yeah, like a nine and a ten. This is what I said. Brought it to an end. Nine and a one. He moved off. He brought it to a death. He ended it. Yeah, because whatever this, this empress, this high priestess was doing out here in the home situation. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever he found out, maybe it was a third party situation. Maybe this high priestess is out here having another lover as well. Because I feel like this emperor, he's pissed off. This heart chakra. Four is also this lover's energy. And with four in reverse can be also mean that this, this emperor didn't feel safe with this, with this. Don't feel like they could trust. They didn't feel the loyalty in this whole situation. He didn't feel like there was any type of loyalty. And he kind of felt it. Yeah, so he turned it down. Turned his four, he turned his heart down on this. He's no longer in this lovey-dovey, balanced four of wands energy in this home situation. Nah, he ended that. He was having some type of concern about this. He felt like there was a third-party situation, maybe. Mm-hmm. There was another lover out here. Mm-hmm. Look. 33. Six. Probably caught this high priestess in home, in bed, in action, in the household. Brought the towel down. That shit is wild and crazy. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that shit is wild. Whatever he saw in this home, honey, he brought it down. He don't feel like he always knew. This lover knew he couldn't trust this high priestess. This wife or this who husband take it how it resonates, honey. He knew something was going on in the house. Yeah, he was concerned. Definitely concerned about what was going on. And when he found out what he found out, honey, it was just like, what? Yeah. Sudden catastrophe. Tower moment. It says catastrophe, accident, things happening very quickly at lightning pace, honey. Okay, so whatever this masculine found out, this main man right here. He brought it to a death real quick. A nine and a one. Ten. Ended it. Yep. Feel like he found out about a third party situation out here. The six is out here. The lovers is out here. Mm-hmm. So oh, shit. All right. Clarify this magician. Yeah. Yeah, honey. He, 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 he was done. Seeing the betrayal, honey. He was done. He brought that shit to an end. This male man, this main man, done. Ten of swords, honey. Brought it to an end. They go to nine and a one. Nine and a one. Ten. I can't make it up. I can't make it up. Definite ten out here, honey. Oh, shit. Clarify this magician energy spirit. I feel like, yeah, the master will walk away. Put it to an end. He went in. I feel like he went in. I feel like the yeah with the seven and the one out here. Yeah, this masculine went in or this feminine take out resonates seven and an eight. 
They got some clarity out here. They brought down the judgment out here. They, they made their decisions very clear. Okay? They realized whatever they was uh, manifesting in with this high priestess, this lover out here. Yeah, they turned this two of cups in reverse, honey. They're done. No more. They're done. They found out some type of truth with the seven of cups out here. They found out this person had another lover. Feel like they was out here cheating. Yeah. Definitely. Had many other options. Uh-huh. And had them at home in this illusion. And this four of wands energy in a home situation. Like it was all good. And that masculine was like, I don't think so. You're not going to have me here anymore. I'm done. Definitely done. Whatever he found out, honey. Whatever he was concerned about. Lord have mercy. It was wild. I feel like they, they yeah, they found out their partner had more than one partner. It was the lovers out here. Six, six. Three and a three is a six. Six represents this lover as well. There's no communication, no harmony out here. Maybe every time this masculine went to this high priestess, this feminine energy to talk about something, she would just wild out. Okay? She would just come, get up in this defensive energy. Start bugging. You know what I'm saying? But he was bringing this concern to her. You feel me? I said, he kind of had a nudging like, yo, I feel like you're having a third party situation out here. And I feel like this, this high priestess, this lover, she was out here wilding out trying to make it seem like, you know, getting all defensive. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Getting all defensive. He had some type of concerns about it, but now she's stressed. Yeah, she is. She ain't got no new beginnings out here. No, she don't. Or no, he don't. Take it how it resonates, honey. Take it how it resonates. No new beginnings out here. He made his final decision and moved off. Ended the situation and moved off. Gained the wisdom, gained clarity, made his final decision and ended it. Brought it to an end. Ten of Swords. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wowzers. Okay, let's clarify, Spirit. It's 11 out here. The 11s are out here. This is spiritual nudging. I feel like he went and find out some type of spiritual work was being done. This is coming out so much. Or somebody's just tapped into their spiritual knowing. You feel me, I said? Somebody's very intuitive with spirit. Some of y'all probably went out and found out what was going on with this magician energy with y'all and brought it to a death. Y'all got clarity in order for this, this main male got clarity to move off. Yeah. Clarify this magician. Occupation. He went to somebody who does this for, for work. Yeah. He went to somebody who can figure out what was going on if this third party situation was really going on. He went to somebody who worked to spirit for also represents spiritual um, spirit guides as well. Yeah. So I feel like this person, he went to somebody and whoever he went to because he was a little, or, he, or this high priestess, she was feeling concerned, okay? She was feeling, she was starting to feel like, oh my God, this is becoming, you know, noticeable. And whatever she tried to do, it got reversed, okay? Whatever spiritual work she went out here to get, to get done, it still brought this death. The masculine found out, okay? Yeah. She didn't get her spiritual abundance and her uh, out here that she expected this balance. This person could be a Libra as well. Yeah. Whatever day she went out here to spend her money on, yeah, to stop this um, from coming to, to an end, from getting this from a, uh, and bringing this to a finale. Yeah, well, too bad. The masculine, I felt like, went out here and found out what was going on. Yeah. I feel like the masculine went out here as well. And now she's tripping. I feel like this this person out here is tripping because they never expected the masculine to see the truth. I feel like somebody went out here, somebody who does this magician work as an occupation. This is where this money was going. And the masculine had to go find out. And he found out this is coming out a lot. He found out. And when he found out, he brought that shit to a death. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that. My rose quartz turned over. I told you. The spiritual work turned over in the beginning. Somebody needs spiritual protection. Yeah. Because it was some type of love magic out here. 
Lord, I take everything as a sign. God knows. God knows. What was ever, whatever was going on was in this home situation. Yes, it was. Told you somebody was going out here in this high priestess energy. Didn't I tell you? Two. Okay. And the one in this home. This is what was going on. This high priestess was going out here spending her money on this person who does this high priestess work out here. There they go. This is what they do for, for a living. This is their occupation. Okay? And this masculine found out. Yes, he did. And when he found out what this high priestess was doing, because he got a nudging. Okay? Two, two, one, one. I feel like they both went. Okay? <laughs> hey, they both went. And for both of them, they go to three and a three. They both was concerned about this. Somebody, somebody was concerned. And when the truth came out, the tower came down. When the truth came out, the tower came down. It was some wild truth out there because I feel like they both. But because I felt like this masculine, like I said, um, I heard that song. Like they was in the home, but they was planning on the low. They was going to a high priestess themselves. Seven and a four, eleven. And when they secretly found out what was going on, they secretly turned this four of wands upside down. But I feel like quietly. Okay. Yeah, I feel like this high priestess started becoming concerned because she realized the main man was looking a little like he was acting different. Mm -hmm. He wasn't acting like the lover he was acting like before. Six, three and a three. Six, lover. He wasn't acting like that. Why? Because when she found out the reason why he wasn't acting like that, it was already too late. Boom. Tower hit her ass. She didn't expect it. She thought she could go back and work these spiritual works, go out here, Go spend her money on this person who does this spiritual work for a living. She thought she could ride off out here and keep this going. Keep this cycle going. She thought she could keep the masculine track from trap from seeing this, this uh, spell work that she was doing or he was doing. Take it how it resonates. Okay? They was definitely going out here spending their money on this to try to keep this balance in this home. But I feel like it was basically a mirroring. Okay? The masculine finally woke up. Seeing what the feminine was doing, this lover was doing, and he and she both went out here to find out what was going on, okay? Yeah. And when they found out, I feel like this high priestess, this feminine, she was shocked. She was really shocked. Yes, she was. These emotions are crazy out here, okay? Got, woo, got wild out here, okay? Shocked. Spiritual shock. Spirit put this in reverse on her and like parked her up like up. Oh, you, you, you didn't think he was going to gain the clarity. You didn't think she was going to gain the clarity. You didn't think my earth sign was going to see this. Okay. They shocked. Really, really shocked. And when they saw it, this masculine dropped that shit and ended it. Done. Tower. Ten of swords. Ten of swords. This is the... um. Yeah, this, this tower came down suddenly. And, the, and I feel like some of them even caught the person in act with another lover. Okay? Yeah. That's what was going on out here. So that's what's going on, my, um, my earth signs. Yeah. That's what's going on out here. Yeah. Four. Somebody was trying to use this four to keep the spiritual, uh, using the spiritual uh, love, love magic out here. Yes, they were. Trying to use this spiritual love magic out here. Trying to keep this courtship going in this home. But it didn't work. Four and a two, six, one. Trying to use the magician energy. This high priestess was trying to use this magician energy to keep this courtship going. But it's empty. It's over. It's a catastrophe. It's done. Ten of swords and secret of tarot says death or ending of a situation or relationship. Over. This courtship is no longer, boo. Over. Okay. So that's what's going on for you, Earth Signs. If you would like a personal read, please like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the um, notification button for when I'm coming with the latest videos. You'll be prompt as well. Um, go ahead and check out my website at livingitpersonal.style. And don't forget to look at, um, check out our Senorita um, Red Bodysuits Ladies. You can get three for 30 or at the original price. Love and light, my beautiful Earth Signs.